I'm usually good with faces, but I don't think I've seen you here before. What brings you to Camp McCarran? Could be better, I'll say that much. We set up here with our sights set on annexing New Vegas. It's a lot of resources that could do a lot of good for us. But that hasn't happened. If anything, they annexed us. They rake in the profits from our soldiers and we're stuck protecting them from the Legion. Not exactly the plan. Now we're trying to secure the Strip and the Dam at the same time, and it's costing us. And in the meantime, General Oliver won't approve any offensive maneuvers because he doesn't want to risk losing our positions. So we're in a holding pattern here. And Caesar's on the other side of the river, planning. There are a lot of things I can't spare troops for right now. If you can help us, we can definitely pay you for your work. Hmm. You don't cook by any chance, do you? Farber's doing his best, but it's hard to manage an army with half my staff in line for the latrine. Honestly, we're fighting a lot of fires right now. The fiends keep pressing their position from Vault 3. We've got the Legion breathing down our necks across the river. We actually took an officer alive last week, but so far he hasn't spoken a word. Yeah, on top of everything else, I can't send a patrol on a bathroom break without it being ambushed by someone who heard they were coming. So somebody's getting the word out. Calm is what you have to be when people look to you. And it's all you can be when things are out of your hands. Hmm, well, why not? Given your recent arrival, at least I can safely rule you out as the leak. I'd like to have absolute trust in my men, but that's just not practical right now. Go ahead and look into it. See what you find. We don't have much to go on right now. Lately, every raiding party in New Vegas seems to have a map of our troop movements. It derails everything. Supplies, reinforcements. And it'll only get worse the longer we let it go on. Captain Curtis is heading up the investigation right now. He can fill you in. Bye. Nice to meet you. I'm Curtis. Officially, I'm in charge of Bravo Company. But since General Oliver has Bravo and most of our forces here garrisoned, I'm free to do other things. So I work with Colonel Shu on logistics, patrols, supply lines, reinforcements, that sort of thing. Lately, it's been less about that, and more about figuring out how that information is getting leaked to raiders. It's a big base with a lot of unhappy soldiers. They get stir-crazy. Hard to separate the malcontents from the actual culprit. Smart man. I could use somebody who can operate under the radar around here. Whoever our mole is, he's been slippery. Whenever one of the MPs gets too close, he changes his habits. Our last lead went cold weeks ago. You want my advice? Start by talking to people with a lot of eyes in the field. People like Lieutenant Boyd, or Sergeant Contreras, maybe. Careful with Contreras, though. He's not above suspicion himself. Keep me apprised of any leads you get. This guy's gotten a lot of my men killed. I'm just itching to return the favor. Later. Took some skills to bring down that fiend. You done good. As a matter of fact, it's funny that you'd ask. A couple nights back, I was on watch in the yard. Got myself a habit of looking all around, not just where I'd expect to find trouble. Old habit, but it saved my hide on occasion. Around about one in the morning, I spied some lights in the control tower. 
Now that's the third time I've spied those lights, mind you. And every time I ask about it, they tell me the place was empty. I'm just saying, didn't look empty to me. No trouble at all. Might be nothing. A couple frisky young folks looking for a quiet place to snuggle up. That light is mighty consistent. Always there at 1 a.m. Might be worth a look. Always a pleasure. Keep yourself safe. I heard you killed Driver Nafai. My team would have liked to get a shot at him. But we're still glad he's dead. If they've proven hard to kill, yes. Whatever it takes to get the job done, even if it means hiring help from outside the military. We're the finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. If you need a bullet put into a target's eye from 800 yards away, you call us. Some of my team aren't without their share of scars, though, like Betsy and Sterling. Cook Cook, one of the fiends, ambushed her in tennis bit. Betsy shrugged it off like it was nothing, but her behavior keeps getting worse. Always making passes at every woman who wanders by. It's inappropriate for anyone at First Recon to behave that way. I could discipline her, but I'd rather she get medical help. I'd appreciate it. As her CO, I could order her to get help, but I'd have her agree with the idea. Corporal Sterling was an NCR Ranger until he was captured by the Legion. They tortured him pretty badly. He wasn't able to be a Ranger after that, but his eyes are still sharp, so I had him transferred to First Recon. We're the finest sniper outfit in the whole NCR. If you need a bullet put into a target's eye from 800 yards away, you call us. Carry on. Contreras is holding out on me. I know he's got more to sell. Colonel Shu really knows what he's doing. Now, if only someone explained that to old General Wait and See Oliver. Hey there, miss. T t t t ten of spades. First recon sharpshooter at your surface. The LT told you about that? Shit, man. That's sh sh shit. It was m my fault. See, I was knocked out when it happened. That big guy sneaked up on us. I let b b Betsy down. Shit, you sound like the LT. I should have woken up. I shouldn't have gotten knocked out in the f first place. That shit was my fault. I don't want to talk about it anymore, all right? Yeah, the LT shouldn't have brought that shit up. Not with civvies, anyway. Ain't right. The LT, Goro Betts gave it to me. See, I'm wanted to be ace of spades but the lt says sorry kid you're t t t too green so he calls me 10 instead i keep at it eventually i'll make it to ace i think i'll skip queen though Are some great A poon. Anybody ever tell you that? Yeah? So what? I could take a bullet in the skull tomorrow. I haven't got time to take it slow and subtle. I see somebody I like, I go ahead and tell her. That's about the only thing that the horn dog males get right. What gave me away? The big gun? The shades? Or the attitude. 
They don't. Only the good ones do. My partner's got some potential, so I let him wear those goofy glasses. I tell him they're his training shades. He totally buys it. Truth is, his eyes just suck. Not unless you count the fiends as serious. Gorobetz keeps us inside the fence most of the time. Doesn't matter to me. I just shoot bad guys. Sooner or later, they'll move us out to the dam, though. That's when the shit gets nasty. Legion fights to win, and they're smart. Hell of a lot smarter than these crazy fiends. But I don't feel bad about shooting Legion boys. Fiends, on the other hand, sometimes I get pangs of conscience. Not often, but sometimes. Yeah, well, we can't all be heartless shitheads, right? The lieutenant's been talking to you, hasn't he? Look, I don't need a head doctor. I'm first recon, damn it. You don't see the others crying about every little bruise and scrape, do you? Damn. Never had you pegged for the drill instructor type, but you got my attention. You can tell the lieutenant that I finally caved. I'll get help. There's a Dr. Usanagi who's supposed to be good at this sort of thing. Yeah, I always scare off the hot ones. Shit, I didn't even get a shot at that Nephi bastard before he went down. Oh yeah, f fine, just a little st st stutter. Had it since I was a kid. Doesn't stop me from kicking kick, kick, ass. D damn right. She's my g g g goddamn partner. See, we work in pairs. We spot for each other. W w watch each other's backs. Nobody w w wanted to work with me. They said I was too green, but Betsy volunteered. Shit, you don't even know how big a d d deal that is. She trusts her life to the newbie, and I sit here and let her get raped by that piece of shit. Ain't right to... Shit. As long as I can remember, had a rifle in my hand since I was three. That's what my dad always says. Learned to shoot on our ramp, way west of here. Same as the LT. He's a f f farm kid, too. Kicking ass. M mostly kicking ass. See, we're watching the perimeter right now, looking for those f f fiends to come back. When they show their faces, that's when we go to work. One shot, one k k kill. That's the first recon way. Oh, they recruited me. What? A year ago? Taught me to kick even more ass than before. These guys, they really know how to kick some ass. Yeah, I'll... Hey. What can I do for you? I caught the tail end of what you said to her. Betsy looked like she'd been slapped right back into basic for a few seconds there. Let's hope the Betsy sticks with the treatment. Knowing her, she won't keep seeing Usanagi if she feels things are taking too long. Do me a favor and let Usanagi know Corporal Betsy is coming. I'd like to make sure the medical clinic has time for her. Carry on.
Hey, can't you see I'm busy here? Nah, I'm just kidding. This has to be the most worthless patrol duty on the whole base. They never attack this gate. They just put me back here because they don't think I can handle anything else. Catch you later. You look like someone in need of a reliable supplier. You mean other than some stranger with no military ID interrogating me inside our base? Did Boyd put you up to this? I'm so sick of this harassment. You tell her to stop wasting my time with this bullshit. No, I haven't seen anything suspicious. It's been business as usual. Take your pick. Satisfied customer. Later. That's not a good idea. You're back. Now what kind of MP would I be if I didn't notice anything suspicious? I've had soldiers go AWOL, break-ins, thefts, you name it. Well, there's Anders. He's a ranger. That one's not suspicious so much as worrisome. He left on a dangerous assignment. Colonel Shu sent him out. Now I think he feels guilty not having any way to check up on him. very well myself. I seem to remember that he was the man to call on if you needed someone to get in and get out quietly. Colonel Shu would really be the person to talk to. Maybe break-in isn't the right word. We didn't find signs of forced entry, but I've had reports of someone sneaking into the control tower at night. It's probably just a meeting spot for a steamy military base love affair. <sighs> Kids today. But it bothers me that they didn't break in. It means they have an access code. Most soldiers around the base don't have that. Sure, if you want to investigate. It's not like there's anything to steal up there. Just a bunch of old communications equipment. If you can find out any more, I'd be interested to hear it. There's something about this I really don't like. And if I weren't tied up here, I'd be staking it out personally. Not the kind of things you like to see go missing. No witnesses yet. I've got my money on Sergeant Contreras, who's supposed to be in charge of distribution, the little weasel. But he's too slick to let anyone catch him doing it. We've searched his possessions a dozen times. Nothing. Good. The more guns you can recover, the more I'll be able to use to shoot Contreras for being inept. Yep. See you around.
Lupa, this is Frumentarius Picus. Over. Go ahead, Picus. Afternoon patrol enters fiend territory at 13. What are you doing here? You don't have clearance. I can't let you leave. Hey! You like that? Afternoon patrol enters fiend territory at 1300. Have them mind that stretch. 10-4, Picus. Fiends will be alerted. Roger, Lupa. What's the status of your primary mission, Picus? Charges are set. What are you doing here? You don't have clearance. I don't know what you mean. Charges are set. Detonation will occur as the train leaves the station. Over. How long? Couple of minutes. Over. 10-4. Keep us updated. 10-4. What are you doing here? You don't have clearance. Really? And how would you know where I'm supposed to be? I don't know what you mean. Yes, what is it? No? What happened? Curtis? He's been in the NCR long before our conflict with the Legion. There's just no way. I hope you're mistaken, but somehow I don't think so. It explained a lot. This is much worse than anyone expected. There could be others, too. You've done everything that was asked of you. You have my personal thanks for this. And I'll make sure you receive the credit you deserve. I'll have Curtis taken into custody. If he lets himself be taken alive, that is. 
ไปเดี๋ยวคุณมีเมดิคัลอัตเทนชั่นมีเมดิคัลอัตเทนชั่นมีเมดิคัลอัตเทนชั่นมีเมดิคัลอัตเทนชั่นมีเมดิคัลอัตเ